Oh, my God. You know what we'll be? What? Brits, then. The three E's. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Uh, what'd you say? Are you up for it? Oh, man. <sighs> Please, you have taken this the wrong way. I did not mean to be rude. My guitar has never fit me before. Except this time. I'm getting quite a buzz out of this. Hope it doesn't become addictive. <laughs> I think maybe you should have nicked a better car, mate. When did I get the memo? About what? Didn't realise it was Eddie's night. Hey, what you want about this shirt? It's decent. Yeah, for crossing the road when it's dark. I can't wait. I'll see you later. See ya. One happy bimbo. Oh, no. Anyway, what? mustache. Mustache! <laughs> mustache! I just got it! <laughs> it's, it's quite good, actually. Stand. Look at this, Bren. It's an antique, genuine 1970s. I found even the with the man himself. Wow, wow, that's John. He just doesn't understand the Gallic mind. <laughs> hey! Go <laughs> room! What was it, a caravan? I forget. Oh, oh mate, help me out here! Oh. What would you like me to do? Oh. This guy is mental. Maybe I didn't make myself clear, Joseph. The photos and the camera do not leave the building. They do not leave the building. Oh. <laughs> Have a drink? Or something stronger? Yeah, not for me, thanks. I'm driving, remember? So you are. Sensible, I like that. Stay. Good boy. So you saw me kissing Maka then? Is that why you went mental at him? What's wrong? Were you jealous? Jealous? Of Maka? Have you... Have you seen my face? Happy? Yeah, well, she's just a big fella guy, Candy. Who? Mitzi. I don't think I'm in there, though. She's a nice girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm only joking! <laughs> Which is why I'm gonna take you out later. How do you know I'm not busy later? Well... You do that for me? For us? Sorry, skis. Oh! Oh my god! Oh, oh. Yeah? Still not letting Brendan hit you? How'd you get in here whenever you want? What's your name? Mariah Carey. See? Do you really want to push it? <sighs> Kathleen McQueen. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> here. Money. Thank you. Good luck. I suppose you'd be hoping she pays you back for your kindness. No, I'm doing this because I care. <laughs> ha! Oh, there's six more crates. Oh, that's great, yeah. Just think of it. Who knows, maybe at the end you could have a voice set. Shut up! Mm. Uh, you're Irish. Oh, love a good look, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Sorry. Oh! oh! I didn't see that. Well, that's not a problem. That's not a problem. These are nice. These are nice. <laughs> hey. How did you get in here? S Stephen, I've been looking for you everywhere. What do you want, Brendan? I, I never had to down a Stanley's little lap dog. Well, tickle me pink and call me woof. You'll never guess what he's just asked me. He said, do you have a boyfriend? If I what? Hello. Can you believe it? I think it must be the way you're doing your hair, though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa there, cowboy. Calm yourself down, okay? Yeah, that's, that's, that's good, yeah. It's meant to make you laugh. Yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. Look, Stephen, I'm hardly Snow White, am I? Last thing I need are cops sniffing around. You know me better than anyone. You hand over that message to the police, and it's going to cause me a whole heap of trouble that I don't need. Yeah, that's my point. And I'm going to cause you a whole heap of trouble that you don't need, mate. Yeah. I'm just so glad he's found someone so nice. <laughs> you, you, um, you so don't know me. <laughs> yeah, look at the lads over there, surrounded by heaving breaths. Like two kids in a sweet shop, eh? I'm sure those two will manage to contain themselves. 
Do you understand? Spot of trouble there, Foxy. Hey. Bacon? It's good? No. Get out and push. Seriously. Oh, I know. We'll stick down here in the taxi, shall we? Mr. Fox, having some car trouble. Bud, give us a push, if you're not busy. All right. DC Scott, Brendan Brady, my sister runs the bar in there. Which one of us are you going to believe? That, honestly? <sighs> it was a simple mistake. Or we'll make it twice. Excuse me? Next time you'll be crawling out of there with your teeth in your hands. Dicky Bell was nice. The less you say in front of the lady, the better. Stephen, I just need a chat about Ray. No. I'm not leaving her on her own, no. Give us a minute, Stay. Because I could do with a laugh. I'm going to be next to you, bye. Six o'clock, having drinks with India. Here we go. Yeah, sounds good. Uh, well, I mean, we'll see what we're up to, won't we? Yeah, might just end up having a quiet night in, because we're absolutely not good. Seriously? What are you, 18 or 80? SU bar, 6 o'clock. See you there. Let's go. Okay. Oh, I said so quick. Oh. It's a shame you've got to work. Oh, I'll see you later. Then we can pick up from where we left off, yeah? You can count on it. I'll see you. Mm-hmm. Hi, Warren. Do yourself a favor, Stevie boy. Delete the voicemail. Pretty please. With a cherry on top. Does it hurt if I do this? Oh, hey! Yeah, bro. <laughs> what are you doing here? I know. I know. I should have bought you flowers. It was very rude of me. I'm oh, sorry, the barmaid said you were down here. Uh-huh. Just telling young Stephen here that he needs to toughen up, isn't that right, Stephen? Yeah. Always getting yourself in trouble, aren't you? <laughs> Good talk.